Let's take a look at how to add the clean print extension to your Google Chrome browser. So I've got Google Chrome opened here and I'm on the most visited page where it keeps track of my most visited sites. Down at the bottom you can also click here to go to um, apps that you have on your Google Chrome and then keep going to the right and you can go to the web store. I'm going to click on web store and that's going to take me to the store where I can get apps or extensions or themes. I'm going to go up to the search and type in clean print and I will search for clean print and you'll see it takes me to results in clean print but it's on apps. So these are apps and I want an extension for Chrome so I'm going to click on extension and here is clean print. You can click on it to read a little bit more. It tells you how to use it um, how to install it. I'm going to go ahead and just click on the blue button and add to Chrome. It's going to ask me if I want to add that extension to my Google Chrome. Click add. And then up here you see the little box and the little green leaf that was placed up here that shows that clean print has been added to Chrome. And so once it's added you need to restart the browser. Once you restart the browser you can then go to a website and um, print it and edit, highlight, choose what you want to print and either print it or save it to a PDF or share it with your social networks. So now that I've um, restarted my browser, let's just go to a website and pick an article. So here's an article and if I want to print it, I just click that leaf and then it lets me optimize that content so it's it's cut out the video, it's cut out all the extra stuff and I can um, click on things I want to get rid of and only print what I want. So this lets me delete if I only want a paragraph I can do that and um, if I want to undo what I just did I can add in the pieces I deleted and print the rest of the article. So a great way to customize what you're printing, save on paper if I don't want to print, I can save it to iCloud, make a PDF, email it, and other options are listed here. So I highly recommend getting clean print so you can maximize your printing and uh, print only what you want. Thanks.